Hey everybody, welcome to the Real United States. We're here in Westminster, Maryland. Now Westminster is a relatively small town, about an hour's drive north of the Washington DC Beltway. And we are here in a, at a farm market. This is the Bauer Fruit Market. And farm markets like these are fairly common here in the United States. And this time of year in the autumn, very, very popular venues. So of course, Bev and I have been taking an opportunity to go to some of these farm markets this fall and show you a little bit of real rural Americana. Now the Bowers is a big family here in Westminster. And they came here in 1725 when Johannes Badger came here from Germany, but they, he changed his name to Bauer. And they had 13 children, which in 1725 wasn't that uncommon. Large families were the order of the day in the 18th century, especially for agricultural families who uh, they all worked on the farm together to support the family, to support each other. So not an uncommon thing here in the United States in that period of time. Well, over the years, they continued to buy chunks of property and build up the business. And in 1948, they opened this market and right next door, the Bauer Family Restaurant, which we're going to visit probably in a separate episode. So anyway, point is, is this is an opportunity for them to bring all of their agricultural products into one place at the farm market and go ahead and offer them to display. And as you can see, very typical sorts of things. We have chrysanthemums behind me. There's pumpkins, there's squash, there's corn. Some of this is decorative, but most of it, of course, is actual, you know, foodstuffs. And you see they have a pretty big spread here. Now the Bauer family has a, another facility a few miles over here, which is the family farm. It's a 600 acre farm, which they have in recent years started doing pick your own. Now there's an event today and the place is packed. Bev and I are not gonna be able to get in there, but um, it is one of the facilities here in Maryland that offers pick your own in this time of year. Of course, people are picking apples but they have peaches earlier in the season, they have strawberries. So it's an opportunity to get out with your family and get into the orchard, get into the, to the fields, select the fruits you want, kind of a neat thing. I happen to like, Bev happens to like, pick your own. Again, unfortunately this year, it doesn't look like we're gonna get there because of the crowds, but we'll see. And so we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna go inside, we're gonna do a little shopping and we're gonna shoot a little video here surreptitiously because I don't wanna be intrusive to anyone and we'll show you around a little bit.
Yeah. 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 A white pumpkin. No, I've never had white pumpkin, and I think this is the only second time I've ever seen them. But it's going to be cute for my decorations, and afterwards we'll cook it and see what it tastes like. Squashed. And no, I've never had them before. We're going to get a couple and try them. They look really good. They look like a super sweet butternut squash. So I'd like to thank you for joining us here in Westminster, Maryland, Ed. And I'm sorry I mispronounced it. It's Boggers farm market and I hope you've enjoyed this this short visit this is this is fairly typical of a farm market here in the United States and what the autumn fair looks like so I hope you've enjoyed this if you got questions or comments leave them in the comments section below I love hearing from all of you I try to get back to everybody I can hey if you haven't already come on pick subscribe come along for the adventure we got lots more to show you and as always thank you for watching